We are talking about essentials, classics, basics, but elevated. Don't be basic without being elevated. Now, turtlenecks. Seems very confusing to some people, but I was this many years old today when I found out that turtlenecks are actually supposed to be tucked in this way to make them look like this. Blazers are my everything. If there's one thing that you need from this haul, honey, it is going to be the blazer. Wait a minute, we're looking chic. I wanna be apologetic now. You're probably gonna see me in every post with this blazer on. And if you want, we can even go ahead and layer, layer, layer. Give it a little bit of a, a vibe. Speaking of vibe, if you think I'm a vibe, please make sure you subscribe. Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome to this channel. I am Saida Silva and today we are going to be talking fashion, fashion, fashion darling. Also, I live in New York City, so if you hear that there are fire engines passing by, please don't mind that. That's just a little bit of background music, so let's just get used to it. As you can see, I have a rolling rack here, and we're gonna roll right on in. Do you see the textures, the tones? What are we talking about today, ladies and gentlemen? Any guesses? We are talking about essentials. Essentials you need for fall. Classics, basics, but elevated. Don't be basic without being elevated. This video is sponsored today by Everlane. I want to say thank you so much for sponsoring this video because I am a big fan of Everlane. You can mix and match their pieces that will last you a very long time. They are a sustainable company. Some of these garments can last you for years, even decades, because they are absolute classics. So let's jump right into this. We're gonna do a little bit of a try on. You can even mix and match some of these Everlane pieces into your own wardrobe. So I'm starting off with a very beautiful black tank, as you can see here. It is a more of a cropped version. I like the fact that it has this mock neck top. It's not really a turtleneck, but at the same time, it is giving me keep me warm. I have a mirror right here, so I'm gonna look at myself. Then we have a really nice pair of denim that hugs the butt really nicely, fits my frame really well. So what I'm gonna do is I'm also going to style these looks. I think we should give this look a serious vibe. Okay, so we have a green quilted jacket that I threw on on top of this. And just to give you an idea of how I would style it, I would definitely do some gold jewelry here at the top, maybe even some hoop earrings and a pair of sunglasses. And I would pair it with maybe a pair of clogs. Okay, I changed my ensemble. And this is the next outfit. So I went with this beautiful vest sweater. Check out the turtleneck. Now, turtlenecks. Seems very confusing to some people, but I was this many years old today when I found out that turtlenecks are actually supposed to be tucked in this way. So not the opposite way to make them look like this. Now, for me, I really love the oversized feeling of a turtleneck. So I like, excuse me, let me tuck my tags back in. I like when they are like this. It gives me like the long neck, the illusion that my neck is much longer. Then I have some really nice joggers to go with the look. And then for this look, I just went ahead and stuck the joggers in some high boots. Remember the aviator look, like the jumpsuit in the boots? So this is what I was kind of looking for with a pair of aviator glasses. Very like chic, off-duty, effortless vibe. Let's get into the next look. I am wearing the way high jean. These are really, really comfortable. I think that they are very flattering. They fit the bum really nicely. Hey. Uh, I decided to put them on with a pair of loafers. The sweater, please get into the texture, the fabric, the design. This looks like it will last you for seasons to come. Loving the detail zipper so we can kind of button it down if we like, or kind of like put it down. I like this. I think that we can do something like this and put on a big chunky necklace situation or we can kind of just zip it and make it into a turtleneck. I think possibilities are endless 
with this sweater. I only had three bottoms, so what I'm going to do is get through, come on over. This isn't high enough is the problem. <laughs> That's better. I had to prop you guys up just a tiny bit and let me bring you down. I only have two pairs of denim and one jogger pant. So I tried those both on for you. What I'm going to do now is try on a couple of jackets as well as some sweaters just so you can get an overall idea of what these pieces look like and how you can kind of mix and match into your wardrobe. That is the key. You want basics that you can put in and out of your wardrobe. I think that this sweater can go with almost anything. You can also mix it with a skirt if you like. But let's get into Everlane Trench. Everything is ethically made, which is great. Oh, first of all, it feels really good. It feels nice. Okay, get into that. Yes. All right, let's take you down so you can see what this looks like. And I am back with a, another top. I'm still wearing the same, the way high jean. I really like how high rise they are. My belly button is in here tucked away and these are really high. Now, usually I am a person who loves a good high waist denim, but I do have a very short torso, long legs, so sometimes denim can make me look a little oompa loompa-ish. But these, I would have to say, they don't do that to me. Instead, they are very flattering and I do like the way they feel. They feel very comfortable. They feel like a staple that you can have in your closet for years to come. I think you're golden. So I put it on with this beautiful turtleneck. It is comfortable. Get into that. Now the turtleneck is not too thick so you can layer it, which is really nice. And especially right now because it's fall, fall starts out with very crisp, cool mornings. And then as the day progresses, it gets a little bit hot and you can take off some of those layers. So that's really nice to know because this is a really nice top. Look, can you see? It's a tad bit sheer, but not sheer enough where it would actually show your undergarments, which makes it really nice. And then speaking of layering, let's go ahead and layer it with an Everlane blazer. This is the oversized Everlane gray herringbone blazer. Blazers are my everything. If there is one thing that you need from this haul, honey, it is going to be the blazer. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. We're looking chic. Are we not? Get out of here. It's just us. It is just an ussy. We are looking chic in the gray herringbone blazer. Now, get into the sleeve. Hold on. Let's focus. Woo! You saw that? Did you see that detail? And I would pop the collar here, just like this. Pop it. Pop it. Throw on a pair of sunglasses. Don't smile, okay? We're giving Victoria Beckham posh. Don't smile. How is this looking? Are we feeling posh? Are we feeling chic? Do I look Parisian chic? Throw it on with a pair of clogs. Yes, I'm really, really liking this blazer. Hold on, let's take a look at what it looks like full body. Okay, so what are we thinking overall? Would love to hear your comments, please. Feel free to comment down below if you have any favorites. Also, there is a discount code in my description box. Make sure that you check that out because we all need the blazer. Let's keep the party going. Next up, I'm going to go with Everlane Cashmere. Let's try this on with the pair of jeans that I have right now. And again, this stuff is all meant to be mixed and matched. So whether that be whatever you have in your closet and you see some essential pieces here, or you can just kind of do a capsule collection because all of these pieces, they go so well together. So let me try this on for you so we can see what this looks like. So this is the cashmere sweater. Get into this. I love the little stitching here on the side too, this little Everlane stitching. Looks really cute. 
makes it feel very elevated and luxurious. Don't we like luxurious? I love luxurious. I love cashmere in the winter time. It is warm, it feels good, it's comfortable. I'm really liking the collar part of this. And look at this, do you see this? Um, the patterns are completely different, which also makes it look very expensive. This top also comes in five different colors, which is really nice. And I wanna show you something that is very similar that they also have in cashmere. Their cashmere polo, love. Love that it has this slit so you can really layer it with some dainty pieces of jewelry, which would be really nice. Um, even like um, if you have something smaller, like a heron bone and then another piece and maybe a locket necklace would be really pretty um, with this top as well. And again, this is the cashmere polo. Feels really good. Check this out. I kind of want to rub it on my face because that is the true testament when I'm trying something on. Will it be itchy or will it not? I will usually take it and rub it on my face. But today we have on makeup. No, 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 we cannot do that. This is just a really nice collared top that you can wear so many different ways. You can also pair it with a pair of nice leather trousers, which would be cute. You can put this quilted jacket back on top, which I really like. I love army greens for fall. Army greens for fall are really nice. Sorry, I'm bringing this jacket back up. But I just love the versatility of all of these pieces because they can be paired so well together. Give me one second while I check myself out in the mirror. I mean, it is cute, right? Let's put on some sunnies, darling, because they are right here. All right, so picture me rolling, just hanging, doing kid pickup, kid drop off, saying hi to the parents. Afterwards, I'm gonna go for a coffee. Hi, coffee. To the office picture me going to the office and then sitting down right chic we are back with the last tea now this is the everlane ribbed tea can we get into that do you see this yes it fits really nicely i think it fits the body very well it is comfortable it is not strangling my arms you can tell that it is quality fabric Get into this so you can see the fabric. I really, really like this. It feels really good on, matches the jeans very well. Hold on, I thought there was a banister here. <laughs> what I'm gonna do now is, I'm gonna pair it with this jacket. I just have this obsession with flipping up my collar. You remember that movie Grease? Where it was like, Fonzie, which is flip up his collar, that is my jam. This feels good. This is a really nice jacket. I love the color on it. Now there is something about this jacket that is giving me a vibe. You can cinch in the waist. It is adjustable, so get into this. Whoop, yes, give it a little bit of flavor. I think that you can cinch in the waist just a bit and it gives it some structure to the jacket, which is really nice. You can also push up those sleeves just a bit, and then you can either button, you can either button it or leave it open or leave it closed. I think it is overall a really nice piece to add to the collection. And then with any of the pieces that I was wearing earlier would look really good with it, such as some of the turtlenecks or the cashmere pieces. I think this would also pair really well with the joggers that I wore. I think that could be a really good idea. And if you want, we can even go ahead and layer, layer, layer. Don't be afraid to layer. We can go ahead and do a trench on top. We can do our turtleneck back on top, which could be nice. Options, we have options, darling. We all need options. Okay, guess what? It is time to go. That flew by, right? Wasn't that pretty quick? I thought that was a very fun essential haul. Okay, so that was 14 basic essential pieces from Everlane that you can mix and match in your wardrobe that you need. Comment down below with some of the pieces that are your absolute favorite, favorite. I'm gonna be honest with you. I wanna be apologetic now. You're probably gonna see me in every post with this blazer on. But all that to say, guess what? Now it's time to say goodbye. Make sure you subscribe. You know I'm gonna sing, you know I'm gonna sing. I'm always gonna make my own song. Give me a thumbs up, comment down below, and I will see you guys in the next video. Deuces.